as they come down to the final flight, generalization with Bro Gehen, the artful Roger making ground on the far side between horses is Chiavari. He's okay on the outside with Iconic Lady and then City Limits. And Chiavari is coming there over on the far side to just lead at the last. Bro Gehen on the near side, Iconic Lady, and he's okay as they run up towards the finish. It's Chiavari and John Fitzpatrick on the near side was Iconic Lady. As they come down to the final flight, generalization with Bro Gehen, the artful Roger making ground on the far side between horses is Chiavari. He's okay on the outside with Iconic Lady and then City Limits. And Chiavari is coming there over on the far side to just lead at the last. Bro Gehen on the near side, Iconic Lady, and he's okay as they run up towards the finish. It's Chiavari and John Fitzpatrick on the near side was Iconic Lady, who put her head right down on the line with Bro Gehen in between horses and he's okay next. As they race down the hill to the final flight and Scarpetta is driven to the front on the far side, quickly followed through by Peregrine Ron, who's coming there one off the rail, and then Sandy Mountjuke who's dropped back, Robin Hannon is next down to the final flight, and it's the main two, Scarpetta, Paul Town and Peregrine Ron, Barry Gerty, and Scarpetta is over, stretching on a couple of lengths in front as they run to the finish in numbers for Paul Town, and it's all the nines, 99 for the season, Scarpetta wins. As they race down the hill to the final flight, and Scarpetta is driven to the front on the far side, quickly followed through by Peregrine Ron, who's coming there one off the rail, and then Sandy Mountjuke, who's dropped back. Robin Hannon is next, down to the final flight, and it's the main two, Scarpetta, Paul Town, and Peregrine Ron, Barry Gerty, and Scarpetta is over, stretching on a couple of lengths in front as they run to the finish in numbers for Paul Town, and it's all the nines, 99 for the season, Scarpetta wins from Peregrine Ron, Sandy Mountjuke, and then Static Jack. Napoleon Blue and Sean Flanagan come through to pick it up. Sophie's Best is running on strongly on the outside for Brian Hayes. Then Mossy White and Dennis Hogan with Darling Mist not out of it. And then comes Loch Lua as they come to the final flight. Napoleon Blue, the leader, jumped it very well indeed. With on the near side, Sophie's Best beginning to close. But up towards the line, Napoleon Blue is another winner for Sean Flanagan and Adrian Murray. Napoleon Blue and Sean Flanagan come through to pick it up. It up. Sophie's Best is running on strongly on the outside for Brian Hayes, then Mossy White and Dennis Hogan with Darling Mist not out of it. And then comes Loch Lua as they come to the final flight, Napoleon Blue the leader. Jumped it very well indeed, with on the near side Sophie's Best beginning to close, but up towards the line, Napoleon Blue is another winner for Sean Flanagan and Adrian Murray, with second Sophie's Best, third is Darling Mist and fourth Mossy White. Cuba Mania is the leader down the hill to the final fence with Ben Rubin trying to conjure up another effort on the outside as they come down towards the last and Ben Rubin and Mark Enright come to press. Cuba Mania, Davy Russell over the last. Ben Rubin is gone. Ben Rubin is down and it's Cuba Mania left to win the Pierce Maloney Memorial Novice Chase as they run up to the finish. Mark Enright is half up but Cuba Mania is the winner by a wide margin. Cuba Mania is the leader down the hill to the final fence with Ben Rubin trying to conjure up another effort on the outside as they come down towards the last and Ben Rubin and Mark Enright come to press. Cuba Mania, Davy Russell over the last. Ben Rubin is gone. Ben Rubin is down and it's Cuba Mania left to win the Pierce Maloney Memorial Novice Chase as they run up to the finish. Mark Enright is... Half up, but Cuba Mania is the winner by a wide margin with in second place Jets and third of four finishers. Coming down towards the final fence, it's Sizing Room the leader with Be a Beneficiary taking up the chase at the final fence. And it's Sizing Room with Be a Beneficiary closing on the outside. The pair have it between them as they run up to the finish. It's Sizing Room with Be a Beneficiary still coming on the near side. Up towards the finish, Sizing Room on the far side has just got home in front. 
coming down towards the final fence. It's sizing round the leader with Be A Beneficiary taking up the chase at the final fence. And it's sizing round with Be A Beneficiary closing on the outside. The pair have it between them as they run up to the finish. It's sizing round with Be A Beneficiary still coming on the near side. Up towards the finish, sizing round on the far side has just got home in front from Be A Beneficiary with taking third capture of the drama and fourth is celebrity status. As they race down to the final fence, it's the Mulcair Rover from Sizing Joshua, Stushy, Tinnahinch, You Can't Catch Me, another Barney. It has an open look to it as they come down to the final fence, You Can't Catch Me on the near side. Just leads at the last from Sizing Joshua, the Mulcair Rover, and down is another Barney, and it's You Can't Catch Me, and JJ Slevin. Stushy is staying on against the rail, but it's You Can't Catch Me from Stushy as they run towards the finish. You Can't Catch Me has it from Stushy as they race down to the final fence. Fence. It's the Mulcair Rover from Sizing Joshua, Stushy, Tinnahinch, You Can't Catch Me, another Barney. It has an open look to it as they come down to the final fence, You Can't Catch Me on the near side. Just leads at the last from Sizing Joshua, the Mulcair Rover, and down is another Barney, and it's You Can't Catch Me, and JJ Slevin, Stushy is staying on against the rail, but it's You Can't Catch Me from Stushy as they run towards the finish, You Can't Catch Me has it from Stushy, and third is Sizing Joshua, the Mulcair Rover is fourth, and they're clear from 10 inch all black to plus next and up And Scalore has almost on ship Richie Deegan and has put it out of the race as Jukop has now been sent on into the lead from Soviet Pimpernel from the back of the field and then the Gabby Cabby and Black Hills of Dakota staying on but it's Jukop and Michael Stenson in front as they run up towards the finish in the www.turlessraces.ie bumper and Jukop goes on to score for Michael Stenson and Scalore has almost on ship Richie Deegan and has put it out of the race as Jukop has now been sent on into the lead from Soviet Pimpernel from the back of the field and then the Gabby Cabby and Black Hills of Dakota staying on but it's Jukop and Michael Stenson in front as they run up towards the finish in the www.turlessraces.ie bumper and Jukop goes on to score for Michael Stenson second Black Hills of Dakota Soviet Pimpernel third and fourth is the Gabby Cabby